I'm John Levin from Dokken. He wants to keep the leverage of the pressure of the deposition. I practice you know, family law and I also do some entertainment law. Grew up in the five towns. And I was always a guitar player. I was in a band Warlock before Dokken in the 80s. I played my first arena when I was only, you know, 21 or 22 years old. Squeezed my school in because I come from a background that have very, you know, I have parents that really pushed me towards the education. You know, I've been listening to John play the guitar since he's about 12 years old. I'm John's brother-in-law. Not only is he a great guitar player, but he's a fantastic lawyer. He just doesn't practice on the side. He really has a substantial practice. And it was law that actually got me back into the band because I ended up representing Jeff Pilsen. He's the original bass player in Dokken. I got the phone call that, hey, we have, we're, we're headlining the Dallas Starplex. Can you learn all these songs and do this, the gig? I'm like, absolutely. So I went from not really playing at all for a few years and all of a sudden we're headlining for 20,000 people. In the beginning, what I would do is I'd have a makeshift office in the back of the tour bus, and I'd be dealing with something that's a pressing situation, literally right up to the point of a few minutes before the tour manager would come get me and say, hey, you got to get changed and let's go. As Long Islanders, we should be proud of him because, you know, he's a Long Island boy. I think the excitement when you perform is what really gives you the energy to come out and do the best you can. We did the Walken Festival. They sold 75,000 tickets to that, so that was just unbelievable. We just did that this summer goes to court in a suit and pulls his hair back and he, and he looks like a very professional attorney. When he's traveling with Dokken, he lets his hair down and he's a rock star again. Because in court, you never really know what's gonna happen, you know? At least with the band, no, well, actually with Dokken, you never really know what's gonna happen either. 